What's up guys and welcome back to the channel. Now the streets have been talking and apparently Beyonce and Jay-Z could be headed for a divorce. Yeah, you heard me right. Divorce. Now if this were to happen, it would be the biggest divorce in entertainment history. I mean, this is Beyonce and Jay-Z we are talking about here. They have won a combined total of 56 Grammys and even more awards outside of that. They have both accomplished a lot financially as well. So now the reason why the streets have been anticipating a divorce on the horizon for this couple is the fact that apparently there's a lot of shady things that are about to come out about Jay-Z and I'm talking like Diddy level stuff or even worse. Now Jay-Z and Beyonce are no strangers to controversy. I mean, there have been numerous reports that their marriage has been contractual from day one and that it was never based on real love. Also, I think what alarmed people when they first started dating back in 2001 was the fact that he was well into his 30s while she was only a teenager. Jay is literally 13 years older than her. Then there's the constant cheating allegations. The most recent one being Becky with the good hair that resulted in the infamous elevator fight between Jay-Z and Beyonce's sister Solange. At the time, the family released a statement saying, as a result of the public release of the elevator security footage from Monday, May 5th, there has been a great deal of speculation about what triggered the unfortunate incident, but the most important thing is that our family has worked through it. Jay and Solange each assume their share of responsibility for what has occurred. They both acknowledge Thayer role in this private matter that has played out in the public. They both have apologized to each other and we have moved forward as a united family. Now what followed after this was the Lemonade album and if you look through the list of songs you'll realize that they worked through it and they even had the year twins. Rumi and Sir after this. Like it's been a lot so the fact that Jay is about to be exposed only makes matters worse for him and his marriage. Also, what's fueling these rumors even more is Jay's speech at the recently concluded Grammy Awards where he was presented with Doc Global Impact Award. During his speech, the production crew kept panning the camera to Beyonce's face and you could tell she was not pleased with what Jay had to say. In fact, there were reports that Beyonce was so embarrassed she wanted to leave immediately and indeed the Carters left immediately after Jay's speech. So yeah. A lot of people have been saying that Jay-Z is about to be exposed and Diddy even apparently intends to snitch. I remember last year Cassie pretty much hit the ground running with her lawsuit against Diddy where she accused him of S.A. and other horrific things that he did throughout their 10-year relationship. When the news of the lawsuit broke, so many other people came up and corroborated what Cassie had said in her lawsuit. Soon after, people like Jaguar Wright started talking about how Jay-Z isn't as innocent as when would like us to believe. Sean Carter is worse. Uh oh. Oh, man. He's smarter. He's patient. He's not sloppy. Mm -hmm. This been lining up people he calls friends and stepping to the side while they get hit by the guillotine for 30 fucking years. Now it's not even been a year since she said this and Jay is already being exposed by some of the people that used to work with him. For example, one of the former Rock Nation artists, M.I.A., came out and accused Jay-Z of conspiring with the Bronfen family to steal her son. Now this family has been linked to all kinds of bad stuff over the years like cults and other weird stuff. Maya went on a whole rant talking about how Jay-Z was cahoots with the Bronfmans. She said, um, my first custody battle was 2013. My child was four, I was managed by Jay-Z, who ultimately was paid by Bronfman's. I sacrificed my career for my child, they ripped me off, copied my style, gave it to their puppets, and shadow banned me on every platform, but it was worth it to save him from the madness of what you know now. She also said, the day I was served, for my child, Rock Nation stopped all communication with me, and all my emails to Jazz asking for help was wiped from my inbox, my home was broken into, and every laptop was taken. I was trapped in Brooklyn on order served that restricted me from leaving Brooklyn for 15 years. This is wild and apparently the accusations are only going to get crazier from here. Cause prior to this, like when Tory Lanez was found guilty in the Megan the Stallion shooting, Tory's father spoke up about the influence that Rock Nation had on the case. Stallion. I get a call from Rock Nation that says, yo, we heard you're going to make a statement about what happened. And it'd be in your best interest if you don't make that statement. You want to know how I feel? I'll tell you exactly how I feel. I got some names that I want to call. Alex Spiro, 
Desiree Perez and the whole Rock wicked Nation. system of Rock Nation, yep. including you, Jay-Z. Yes. Yes. You who yes. say you rose from the gutter, but you have traded and bartered the souls of young men. Yep. And you're still doing it. The only independent witness in this courtroom is a man whose name is Sean Kelly. He came to court and our attorneys he would not even shake their hand after he went upstairs with Kathy Ta and Alex Bart. They met on Saturday before. They met they on Saturday. Met with our Saturday witness. Night. A YouTube blogger by the name of Storm Monroe recently revealed that he got exclusive info that Beyonce and Jay Z's marriage is going down because Beyonce knows that Jay Z is next on the list of getting exposed. He claims that Beyonce and Jay-Z have been living separate lives and ultimately they are headed for divorce. The powers that be, the PTB, the industry, whatever you want to call them, once they're done with Diddy, right? And um, this is going to be going on for some time, but once, I guess you could say the public humiliation, basically after the major documentaries come out, right? After they are done with Diddy, Jay-Z is up next to be exposed. Now the fans have also chimed in saying Jay-Z is always getting exposed for doing some crazy stuff against the people of his community. It's crazy. Jay-Z finally getting exposed. Hope it continues because that's the real snake in the industry. And it wouldn't surprise me when Jay-Z gets completely canceled like Diddy, Beyonce ends up admitting they have been separated for years like Will and Jada. Anyway, guys, do let me know your thoughts on this whole situation in the comments down below. Hit that subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up.